Hello everybody, this is your host Scott Fox speaking and welcome back to another Asphalt stream. I'm joined here today with my lovely friend Jose. Druid Peter, yes. Uh, hello everyone. Oh, you want me to call you Druid Peter? Oh, well, no, you can call me Jose, but I mean, if you're going to introduce me, please. Yes, I put, fair. I put a lot of, yeah, I, I, you... I put a lot of hard work into, you know, selecting my name. Let me guess, you went to a dartboard and was like, mm, okay, these three. The, the, Actually, uh... no. I did even more hard work. I literally, so what I did was, I looked down and to the left, and I noticed that on my desk, there was a book about the druids. And so I was like, aha, divine inspiration, see? That and took a lot of work, too. It did, it did. What about Peter? Where did Peter come from? Did you just oh. look down and continued looking? Uh, so actually, uh, how familiar are you with Love Hina? I don't think I am. Okay, so Love Hina is an anime. It's a, a manga created by what is this? Oh, I have to play this with my Ferrari La Ferrari. That's annoying. Love Hina is an anime and manga that was created by. Some dude. Uh, well, okay. Basically, Love Hina was essentially the um the the manga that essentially invented the harem genre. Actually, like there were no harem anime or manga uh, before Love Hina, and uh, the guy who did it, I don't remember his name, so I'm just gonna call him Kentaro Yobu. Yobu? I'm just gonna call him Kentaro Yobu. Uh -huh. But the point is, is that. Love Hina is about a loser dude who basically made a promise to this girl um, when he was like a kid that he would get into Tokyo University. Um, you know, when they were like little kids and shit. Okay. Well, yeah. And so basically what it was was he was in love with her and it was kind of like a romantic gesture because the idea was if two people attend Tokyo University at the same time... Like, if they make a promise to attend and then they both do it, they're destined to fall in love with each other. And because the guy was basically a little bitch, he said, okay, so so he worked tirelessly to get into Tokyo University because that was the only way he was going to see those, the, the girl again. It's not like she was a childhood friend or anything. Um, unfortunately, you know, it's there's a mystery and blah, blah, blah. Basically, so he's a, he, unfortunately, he's a complete and total loser. And he can't get into uh, Tokyo University. He's like failed twice to get in. He's a second year Ronin. And so he goes to live with his aunt, who uh, is one of the people in charge of. Um... He, okay, he goes to live with no, with his grandmother, who owns a uh, an inn basically. Because he would like to stay stay with her because he doesn't have any more money. And he needs to stay with her so that, you know, while he's studying to get in for the third year. Yeah. Okay, well, it turns out that Grandma actually left on a tour around Europe because she's badass like that. Of course. Um, and the inn was actually converted into a girl's dormitory. So he can't actually stay because men aren't allowed in. <laughs> So the okay. Yeah. So basically, what he ends up happening is, is um, he goes to the end. He doesn't know that Grandma's gone, and he doesn't know that it's an all-girls dormitory. So he decides to take a dip in the hot springs of the inn. Um, and then all of a sudden, this girl uh, walks in. Beautiful girl. Absolutely beautiful, you know, anime girl with huge breasts. And and she's like, oh, hi, and, you know, talking to him because she thinks that he's one of the other girls. I'm, he... I'm assuming this is one of those ones where it, it, it it's a clearly a guy, but it looks like a girl. Uh, no, it's actually, um, she's like insanely nearsighted. Ah. And so she actually can't see him. She just thinks that, uh, he's Shinobu, who is another girl in the end, because of the black hair and facial structure, I assume. 
But the point is, is that, um, so she's like, hey, let me wash you. And then she feels his, his penis because, or his, you know, his junk. And, and then she's like, wait a minute. And she puts on her glasses and he's like, oh no, how did I get in this mess? So he's running away. Basically it's, and hijinks ensue. So basically, um, but funny thing. So he's about to get arrested and go to prison because, you know, of all the things that they think he did, because he's, he's a loser pervert. But at the very last moment, um, Keitaro's aunt Haruka basically shows up and says, Oh, Keitaro, I was wondering where you were. So your aunt actually um, has actually, um, she hasn't passed on, but she decided to um, bequeath to you the inn. So now he's the owner of the place. Which is so no longer in it. Right. So it's still a girl's dormitory, but now he's the owner, so he can stay there. <laughs> so basically, is this guy, he's trying to study for Tokyo University, uh, and um, all while at the same time, he's trying to, you know, live with all these incredibly um, beautiful women and, and hijinks and suit. Yeah. It was the first harem anime, basically. In any case, so... Well, so, that's not what I was expecting our, uh, my first, like, ten minutes of my stream to be, but okay. Well, wait, I didn't answer your question as to where Peter came from. Yeah, I was, like, so, I was trying to figure out where Peter came into all of that. Well, so, the funny thing is, is that Love Hina was the anime that basically set Kintaro Yobu on the map. He was pretty much a no nobody before then. But, as it turns out, he actually made a manga before Love Hina called AI Love You, where all the girls are suspiciously similar to um, the, uh, the situation with Love Hina. And a lot of the girls are suspiciously similar. And um, the main character is pretty much identical. And is, is it, also... Is it really that self. suspicious? Yes. Yes. Like, no, seriously, the main character is literally him. He self-inserted himself not once, but twice into two different mangas. And he got away with it on the second time. The point is, is that the villain of the, um, the first anime was a computer virus called Peter Four. You could have just oh. said, you could have just said Peter came from, was the name of a... <laughs> Anime by, uh, of a virus in, an, in a manga. You could have just said that. No, no. I. You needed context. I. You needed context. It was vitally important. Not really. Yes, it was incredibly important. Considering I don't have any idea what you're talking about at all. Mother clucker. Yeah, for, first first ten minutes of my stream, you're talking about a harem hentai, and I'm just like, okay, okay. It's not a hentai. <laughs> it, it was a harem anime, okay. Oh, I mean, it was actually pretty tame compared to the more modern stuff. I mean, now of course, did you know? Okay, so did you know that there's actually a cursed episode of the um the Daily Show with Jon Stewart? No, I don't watch the so, Daily Show. Well, I mean, The Daily Show's not really... I mean, this is like a long... Wait, you don't watch The Daily Show? Or you didn't watch The Daily Show? I didn't. Oh. Huh. Fascinating. Did you not have cable, or you just didn't like the guy? Never. It just never came up. Oh, wow. Okay. Fascinating. I okay. mean, I probably heard of it, but I just wasn't interested. So, it was, a, it was basically uh, an interview political satire segment thing we're going back in time though uh but basically what's the you know uh ricky gervais there we go ricky gervais was on the daily show with john stewart and okay. they get along really well because they're good friends but the problem is is that um their conversation got away with them so that within the first like four minutes of Ricky Gervais coming on for like the talk show portion of the show. Mother. They actually ended up talking about panda porn. Like for like 15 minutes. Oh. And at the end of it, at the end of it, 
like Jon Stewart was like, this isn't going out on television. It was really quite fascinating. The shit that they got up to. Interesting, and I'm assuming it did end up on television. No, actually, that's why it's called. That's why it's a cursed uh, episode because uh, I actually I tried finding it on YouTube. I couldn't even find it on YouTube. Huh? You think like, it never had, aired? What? It had to have what? aired in order for you to know about it, though, right? No, yeah, I actually. Uh, that's how I actually saw it the day it aired live because they they record the shows live. Or, oh. Uh, Wait, no, they don't. Well, no, they record the shows live, but like... There we go. They record the shows live, but the, the the week before, basically. So they just record, and if there's like an oopsie, they just... They ship it no matter what, basically. Yeah. So I actually saw it the day it went out, and I, I was like, oh my god, this was the funniest episode ever. But I never saw it again. It was so weird. You know? I tried finding it on YouTube, but nope, to no avail. I'm, I'm, uh, frankly, I'm not surprised. Oh? Oh. Yeah. Well, I mean, it was, it was quite interesting because, so Ricky Gervais was like, he was like, well, well, do you think, like, anyone ever, you know, ask something, they ask for something a little bit different from Panda Porn from one to time? And so he, like, <laughs> actually, you know, okay, so the video can be found. I need to show it to you. It's really, really freaking hilarious. He's like, Ricky Gervais was, um, you know what? This is Twitch. I can't really go. Gonna, into yeah, I'm just like, I'm going to ask you to stop. Okay, okay, let's see. Um, what would you like to talk about, Robert? Well, why don't we talk about what race we want to do? Oh, um, you know what? I'm not going to make that joke, so, uh. Let's see. Okay, so club race, right? Club race. Yes. Okay. I have just see. finished my dailies, actually, in the in the uh, time it took you to talk about all that. Oh, let me see. I need to also finish my gold combo. Uh, I'm so close to getting the Lamborghini Asterione. Okay, hold on. Let me do my dailies too. Hold on. What's my? What's my... What were you doing this entire time if you weren't doing your dailies? Working on my career. All right, all right. Club race, club race. What? Where, where, where do you want to go? Let's do Scotland. Scotland's a brave. Wait, do you like Scotland? I do like Scotland. Yes. Okay, let's do Scotland. Scotland's one of my favorites. Let's see. What car do I want? Um, I would like to play with my Volkswagen XL Sport Concept. Which one's that one? And where? What power? 1688, love. So you've got plenty of stuff capable of... 1688. Is the car that I actually want to play with? It's wow. Cool. I need to desperately change this. This is... The color of this car is all wrong. So you think that the... um, mm -hmm. The BMW M4 GTS is pretty good, right? Uh, so it, it's... It's a monster, but it's it's a monster that's um very slow like, to get it, up. No, no, it's 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 underpowered at the beginning, or no, it's 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 you can tell it's it's a monster. Is what I'm saying. Like it's not like the best car, but like when you get it leveled up, you can tell because for what it, how good it is for its rank. It's ex you're, you're like holy shit, you know this thing's gonna be a monster when it's on oh, when it's leveled up all the way. Okay, I hope though because I have it at level at one yeah. star and I'm just like this is very underwhelming. Yeah, no, like at the beginning it's not a monster, but but like you can you can tell it's very um. Have like, you started? What have you started the race yet? Oh, I thought you wanted to do it. But okay, all right, let me start the race. Mm. Uh, I was under the impression okay. you were doing it because you mentioned it. Oh, you mean you didn't want to do a club race? I mean, I, oh. I do want to do a club race. Let's see. Ancient Ruins, Path of the Wind, the Cave, Wildlands, Ghost Ships, Rocky Valley, the Windmills. Holy cow, that's one hell of a race. Let's see. You want to do Ancient Ruins? Let's do Ancient Ruins. We'll do the first one. 
That's okay. Fine. That is very fine. Very, very fine. And I've got this, and I'm creating the race. Ich habe das gereset kreasand. And you're doing your 1688? Yes. I'll give you you're a... Just, you're... Go Sorry? on, go on. Go on. Oh, nice. You're playing with your GT... Uh... That's not the GTR Nismo. Is that just the GT Nismo? That's the 370Z Nismo. From Class there D. we go. I knew Nismo was in there somewhere. I couldn't remember what it was called, though. And also, which car is that one? Is that... Hmm? That looks familiar, but I can't play my. Uh, it is a Vol it is a Volkswagen. Is that the sports concept in Class D? Uh, it's the D. I think so. Oh, I hate that car. Oh really? So weak. I, I mean, at I least at least it is low. It. At least low star like it is. I mean, I never really use it myself because. Wow! Wow! What? <laughs> wow! How did I do it? What are you talking about? You wrecked me, buddy. I did not, because it didn't say I wrecked you. Oh, I see. You pushed me into the wall, and then I got ahead of you, and then I wrecked. Damn! And here I was trying to take it easy on you. I mean, I can't even believe it. Wow! Honestly, I was surprised that you kept scraping paint with me, and I was like, what are you doing? I actually wanted to go the different way, and you forced me on this route, so, like, I guess we're even then. Well, no, I kept scraping paint with you because I needed to go left, or else I was going to hit the middle, the middle of the fort. Could have gone but... right. Well, yeah, but I didn't want to go right. I wanted to go left. Robert. Well, that sounds like a you problem. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? <laughs> That's it. Ferrari Enzo, next race. Come on, let's go. Oh wait, we don't have the Ferrari Enzo yet, do we? I I don't think I have that, no. Yeah. Woohoo! Well, oh well. Honestly, it probably looks it's probably a very fun car, if uh, to be honest with you, because that looks like one that I want. This is the wrong way! Well, I guess you're going to win this one. Also, I'm surprised that we didn't actually crash. It just... We just kept bumping into each other, and I'm not entirely sure how. Is the Nismo that tanky? Uh, no, I could have wrecked you if I wanted to. I just didn't. That's why I was upset. That was oh. like you. Yeah. I swear, I, didn't, was, I, didn't I was intend trying not for you. to wreck you. I swear, I didn't intend for you to wreck, but... Like, I well, didn't well, do it. I, I don't think you realized that, um... Did you know that if I didn't go left that I was going to hit the fork? Or you, you thought there was room? I honestly thought there was room. Also, ah, okay. also, I figured that you would have been like me, where if I can't make it, I'm going to go an alternative direction just so I don't wreck. I mean, yes, but... So, normally, yes, but... I wasn't sure if you were going to go, go, if you were going to move out of the way or not like you know how when two people are walking towards each other oh yeah and they, bo and they both like block each other's way because they they they, they realize they don't realize that they're going exactly like like i'm gonna go left so to get out of this guy's way and then he's so trying the to go person... right to get out of your way yeah exactly that's, yeah. that's what happened so yeah I, I, like I said, I swear I didn't crash you intentionally, but just so you no. know, the game doesn't the game doesn't say I crashed you. And I don't have any. Well, technically speaking, you didn't crash me. What ended up happening was, I didn't know if you were going to get out of my way or not, and you didn't at the last moment. So I ended up hitting the middle of the fork. Ah. And and that that kind of did it. So. Also, I'm really surprised at how much you were keeping up with me in that car. Maybe I just don't have mm -hmm. given enough. Uh, credit, and maybe mine's just not powerful well, enough. Well, I mean, I mean, the thing is, is that, like, our cars were really evenly matched stat-wise, so there just was no way. Once you wrecked me, there was no way I was I was going to fall further behind, but there was also no way I was going to catch uh, further up, either. Mm, I guess I have to 
level mine up because mine is 1362. Oh, mine's 16 something or other. Yeah, I mean, it's I wouldn't necessarily call it like the best car ever. Like, ooh, want to do Himalayas Cave Heat? Sure, what, what car? Okay, so that was 1688. Let me see. I want to use. Uh, what is your Elisa Sprint at? My Elise Sprint. Mm -hmm. My Elise Sprint is uh twelve sixty eight. One okay. I'll I want to do Elisa Sprint. Well, mine's thirteen oh eight. You wanna match yours versus mine, or maybe not. Um... I'm gonna use the Elisa Sprint, but you can use whatever you want. Feel free to get a slightly more powered car. Slightly more powerful car if you want. I'm going to use the Camaro LT. What's that one ranked at? 14. <gasps> I see. 1492. So you you want to you just want to have that advantage, do you, huh? I get the feeling. Oh. Well, the Camaro is not that great of a car. <laughs> the Camaro LT, the Chevrolet Camaro LT. Are you kidding me? That was that's a great car. Is it? Like I, I um, so let me let me clarify. I think it's a pretty great car. I like this car a lot, but in comparison to some of the others, I think it's very lacking. Now, okay, is that D rank or C rank? D. D. Yeah. So that was basically my substitute uh, E tents. Before I could like really upgrade the E tents. Okay, I, I think I, I think I just forgot how good this was because I always felt it was a little underpowered <laughs> after I got it's the. It's a very fun car. It's a very fun car. Yes. Yeah, and I call this my Jolly Rancher. Hey, I can see that. It's got that sort of thick boy vibe, don't it? Well, also I just have a nice bright or a nice deep purple on it, metallic purple on it. Mm -hmm. So it reminds Wait, me of, of a great. Jolly Ranchers are purple. Huh? There's there's Jolly a great a there's a great Jolly Rancher. Ah. Oh. And it just gives me Jolly Rancher vibes when I look at it. So the Jolly Rancher vibes that I get from it are because of how like thick it is. If that makes sense. Uh yeah, like, I can see it's that. Basically, it's basically like. Uh, an edgy rectangle. Yeah. You know, like that's like someone said. How can we take a take a a rectangle and make it edgy? And then they came up with the Chevy Camaro LT. Pretty much. Yeah, I can see that. And wow, like, uh, you're keeping up with me. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Well, the Elisa Sprint is hard to work with, but. Ay ay ay, it's such a pain. I feel I feel like the Elisa Sprint's gonna be huge when we get it up big. Uh, this is difficult. Uh, <laughs> Are you having that hard of a time? Yes, I am. <laughs> the Elisa Elisa Sprint is mid. It's should, mid! Should I, should I have done my Hemi Scat Pack instead? Yes, I would have crushed you. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you yeah, you're joking, right? Because the Hemi Scat yes, Pack is stronger. Yes. <laughs> oh, really? Is it? Yeah, my Hemi Scat Pack is much stronger. Oh. It's 2100. Oh, wow. Damn it. Like, I have my Hemi Scat Pack maxed out. Like as in it's gold? Yes. Oh, and I wrecked. I have both the DSD pens and the Hemi Scat Pack gold. Nice. And I'm working on getting a couple other ones down, including the 370Z Nismo. Oh, the 370. Oh, you want it gold? Yes, I do. Damn. You have a lot of the lower cars golded out then. Well, no, I want it gold. I have, I've only got two gold cars. Oh, which ones are they? The Hemi Scat Pack and DSD Tents. Ah, yeah, I can see that. 
I also only have two D rank gold cards, sadly. Are, are they the ones I mentioned? No. Uh, my two gold are the E tens and the Chevy the Chevy LT actually. Oh really? Yes. Nice. I plan on getting the the Mitsubishi Lancer uh, gold as well. Mitsubishi. Oh yeah, I'm really close to golding out that ass. That bad boy. That bad boy. I am Man. not as close as you are. But it, it it's gonna be amusing that we get what I think is arguably the worst car in the game. Gold. I mean, it's just so adorable. You know, it's like it's like it's like a Chihuahua in a pimp coat. You know? <laughs> Like, that's what it is. Like, you know, I mean, it's like, that's what you want to do to it. It's just so, so adorable. You just want to turn it, you know, it's just like, yeah, you love it. Okay, well, whatever. I don't you think you're making it. it back. What do you mean? Oh, you mean back up to you? Yeah. No, probably not. But I see what Corey means about this car eventually being better than the E-10s. Oh, you, because, you actually feel it. Well, so you know the um, like the three hairpin turns that are um, on that track. You know those like those. You go up the ramp and there's like those three hairpin turns in quick succession. Oh yeah yeah yeah. So she sticks to those turns like a freaking glove. Oh nice. Like it's, yes, like I, I mean to the point where I was able to perfect nitro through them entirely without even needing oh you know, really yes i was able to perfect nitro through them i'm gonna set up ca uh, capital of the world okay so you're gonna do that that's good let me see maybe i'm gonna check my cars maybe i don't have yeah the chevrolet camaro lt is maxed out completely okay so actually i am really close to maxing out my uh lancer evolution okay okay well, I need good. I need two handling or I need uh, two handling upgrades. Uh huh. Uh huh. And one nitrous upgrade. And then that's it would be max. That's it, huh? Yep, that's it. And which one was it? The the Camaro or the the Lancer Evolution? That was the Lancer. Okay, what do I need? Let the Camaro, see. I need a lot. I need, oh my god, I need a lot. Okay, I need a bunch of top speed upgrades. Acceleration upgrades. You're actually a lot closer than I am, then. I'm I also really shit. close to maxing out the 370Z. The 370Z. Oh yeah, I have that one completely maxed out. I love that one. It's a great backup e tense. All right, so let's see if I if we're gonna do this, let's do. I'm using my Chevrolet Camaro ZL1 50th edition. Oh, that's what you want to use, okay? Um, yes. 19. Let's see if I can keep up with a Huracan. What? What's your Huracan ranked out at? My Lamborghini Huracan Super Trofeo Evo, my Class D. All right. That's that's. It's sixteen. Right? It's sixteen thirty-two. What? Wow, you're giving yourself quite the handicap. Oh, how bad is it? Well, my my car's rank is 19. Oh, then I am not going to try that. Yeah, you're like that's I like... would. I thought you were. Uh, I don't know why, but I was looking at mine and thinking mm -hmm. and thinking yours Did was mine. Same... <laughs> oh, you thought mine had the same? Yeah, because mine's 1576. Oh wow! Damn. Okay. Yeah. I didn't realize. Yeah. And and there you go, putting a slightly better car, huh? Let me see, these are actually better rims. I am in that case, if you're doing that, um so I know that the Ferrari Monza SP one sucks at low level. <laughs> it's it's a lot better when it levels up. Are you really gonna put your Ferrari Monza when you No, oh I'm not. I'm not because it sucks. I mean, I don't know, man. I mean, against those hyper cars, it was ducky. But against a car like the Chevrolet Camaro ZL1, it might actually be pretty. Because what, what's its rank? 
twenty or two thousand. And then nineteen twenty seven. Try it out. Let's see. It'll probably beat my beat my uh my silicon. I was actually, I was actually gonna use the um damn it, that was the wrong thing. I was actually gonna use the um Viper. Which oh the Dodge Viper ACR? Yeah. That will crush my car. But go ahead, do it. I mean, mine's only 1923. Oh. Well, let's see. Let's see how it goes then. We'll have to see. Oh, no. TTV Baba Yaga. What are you they talking went... about with that? That's the person who's watching me. Oh. Well, who, who was watching, but they're Oh, he didn't now. come back. Yeah, he didn't come back. Or they didn't come back. I don't know if it's a guy or a girl. Fair enough. They, yeah. Uh, right. Race is up. Let's see. All right. Yay! It's the prize, bitch. You're gonna face my my McLaren Evo. No, okay, yeah, no. I'll be like, I I'm not gonna win though. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> McLaren Evo uh, is a really good car, and I think I only have like one car that barely outclasses it. I need to start upgrading that puppy. All right, let's see how the Monza fares. I'm not using the Monza. Oh, that's right. You're using Dodge Viper? Yes. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. It starts. I'm not trying to crash you. We shall see. I have heard those words before. Wait. Are you behind me? I am because um, in an effort not to try and crash you, I ended up hitting a wall. Oh. You know what? It's okay. You can crash me. If I can catch it's up. Of, it's part of the game. Yes. And besides, I needed to learn how to catch I needed to learn how to crash anyways. Wow, I forgot how good this car was. I had so much fun with this car. I need to level mine up and get it back into production or into use. Cuz it really is a good car. It's just uh, it's just there's too many other cars that are just a little bit better. Like, okay. I don't use use it because of my Dodge Viper ACR, you know? Yeah. So I am it's, it's... so being reckless right now trying to catch up. All right. That is how innovation is made when you're reckless. That's true. We... Uh... We probably would come up with a way to make better warp drive by sticking two warp engines together. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit, I don't know what happened. I don't, uh, I don't know, but you're still in first place because apparently the game likes you. No, I, I thought for whatever reason that um, the, the race was over. And so I, I, I just I stopped steering and I ended up falling into the water. So... Okay! Ow! <laughs> What? I perfect. I I uh, ult uh, nitro boosted. Uh, right into a wall. Oh, ooh, not fun. Not fun at all. Well, I can't win them all. Uh, um. Yes, you cannot win them all. Uh. Uh, Doesn't mean I'm not going to try. Damn. Wait, so your Dodge Viper ACR was like around the same rank as me? Yes. And yet, well, that's right, you wrecked though, Did, didn't I wrecked yeah. and and I was being a bit aggressive and I'm trying to correct it, but yeah, I don't think me, I'm going to make that. <laughs> okay, so I wrecked now, so are you closer to me or no? No. Apparently the game likes you and will and keeps you. I wrecked again. Let's see. Okay, I wrecked three times. Well, now I oh, just overtook shit. you. <laughs> okay then, let's see if I can win. We're at sixty-four percent. Here we go. Wait, what? Oh no. Uh, okay, next lap. All right, all right. Let's see if we can do this. It's, oh shit! Okay, that was not intentional. <laughs> Did you leave the track again? And now it becomes a real challenge. I all right. I don't right, think you should have right. should have let me catch up because 
we're close enough, and I think the Dodge Viper is strong enough that I should be able to keep ahead. Well, let's see. I mean, it's all Ow. right. It's more interesting. I need to stop hitting the wall. Yeah, that that might help. Oh, you are catching up to me. Well, shit. Okay, around this corner. Ow! I am sorry. I am sorry, Robert. Um, I, know I you had won. no choice. I had no choice. I mean, I'm now so Vinci did it on purpose. <laughs> At first, I was well, like, oh, well, he didn't okay. do it on purpose. No, I did not actually do that on purpose, but I knew that if I took the corner... Okay, actually, so it's not that I did it on purpose, Okay. but I knew that if I took the corner the way I, I, I wanted to, to get the, the best angle, it was going to happen, and oh, I hey! wasn't going I to be able up. To, to stop it. I leveled what do you up. Mean you leveled up? I'm reputation level 32. Wow. And I, I just got... Game like you <laughs> and I just got a full refill on all my gas. Reputation level 32? Wait, how do you see your reputation level? Um, What could that be? I want to see what my reputation level. What is that? Let's see. Player profile. Oh! Wait, your reputation level is higher than mine. How did that happen? <laughs> wait, what's your... What's your... <laughs> I'm 30. <laughs> wait, how? Yes. The Lord works in mysterious ways, Robert. It's probably because you actually do have been playing more than me. Okay, you know what? Now I want to do my... I mean, do you have anything you want to pit up against my Viper, though? Uh, against your Viper? What's its rating? My Viper is... 2,759. Wait. Like... Yeah. Your Viper can get... The Viper can get that high? Four star... Max rank is 2,816. I have to go oh, past... Oh, that's right. I'm... I'm. You, you knew I was in Gold League, but now you know how I got to Gold League. Okay. I have to go Class uh, A or Class S. To get to 2,800? No. I mean, I mean the Dodge, the Dodge Viper ACR, Class C... Um, right now at four stars is is up uh, is two thousand seven hundred. In order for me to compare. Oh, but you do have a class S car to compare it with. And I found out that the class S car is kind of meh until it's leveled up. What's what's your rank for your class S car? Twenty seven eighty one. Oh wow! Do you want to give it a try? Sure, let's try. All right, this is gonna be. Worrisome. If you win, I will owe you something. I'll do something. You get one free pass to do something. Or one free pass. To, I have to do whatever you say. Fits the club race. Club race. I don't think that's something you have to worry about, but okay. Yeah, true. I'm trying I'm, to come up with something. I'm not, I'm not uh, making a deal like that. All right, all right, all right. You get one free back rub there. <laughs> no, I mean, no, I mean, like, I mean, like, I wasn't going to offer you the same thing. Really, darn! And here I was hoping to to, to force you to move back to Texas. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Oh well. Wow. Okay. Race, race. I want to race. Oh, are you setting it up for me? Oh. I guess I'm setting it up. Oh no, okay, I was just see. asking because I'm in the middle. I'm I'm in the I'm in the um. Oh, I was in in as well. Okay, if you uh, well, let me set it up. I want to, I want to okay. choose choose. Let's let's see what you, let's, let's see what you bring to the table. Okay, let's see. So um, <laughs> just out of curiosity, um, 
absolutely no relevance at all. Uh, what is your least favorite track? Completely unrelated uh, to the, the, the conversation. Probably something in U.S. Midwest or Buenos Aires. Well, what do you know? I swear, Robert, I... It, this is purely coincidental. Okay, race is up. Okay, what? <laughs> okay, I'm not. Ac I'm actually not gonna lie. I actually did uh, select U.S. Midwest Navajo Nation before I asked you. I know. So... I saw it up before I answered. Oh, okay. Oh shit, I'm going the wrong way right off the bat. Well, what the hell? I'm flying! <laughs> Crap, I went the wrong way again. Did you see me fly? I saw you <laughs> off the track. I was like, wait, what? Is he? Where did he go? Oh, then... my handling on this sucks. <laughs> I'm flying yeah. around with like freaking butter. Damn! Is it just the handling or what? Uh, the top speed's kind of meh. What's the top speed? Currently, it's maxing out like 130. One, oh man, shit! One, 180 on wait, a perfect wait. nitro. 180, like kilometers per hour? Miles per hour on a perfect nitro. Oh, okay. You're you have it set up for miles per hour. Mine is set up for kilometers per hour, so we can't compare directly. All I know is... You know, what What do you got? On a, per, on, on a shockwave nitro, I'm over 300 kilometers per hour. But I don't know what that is in MPH. Yeah, okay, do you want to stop and do something else? Uh, or do a, a different race, because this is bad. <laughs> Yeah, I was, uh, I'm gonna quit the race. Okay. I I told you that the sentence I may have the first class S I car. I can't believe it. Yeah, go on, go on. But it's it's surprisingly not great until it's leveled up. The handling is. Wow, I can't I can't believe it. I mean, your car was basically the same as mine. Hey, you have to quit the race. Because... Yes. Okay. All right, let's try something a little covered bridge. What is that? We'll do that. Covered bridge. Let's see here. Oh, okay, hey, so... let me ch let me change my settings so I can do a trick comparison with you. Oh, the trick to KMH. Yeah, I don't know how to do that though. Oh, you go to uh player. Oh, I found it. Oh, okay, good. Good, good, good. Oh, you know what? Let me try. I'm gonna I'm gonna do my uh, Mercedes Benz AMG GTS. I can turn off knockdown camera. Did you? Wait, what? You can? Wow, yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. I would have told you sooner if I knew about that. <laughs> you you can turn it off oh. right where you change the um the units of speed. Oh. Oh, this is gonna be so much better because I hate the knockdown camera. <laughs> Good to know. Good to know, Robert. I. I... <laughs> Huh. Or maybe I want to do a Aston Martin DB11. Uh, What's that I power? Want, I want to improve the DB11, but it's... Uh... What's your Aston Martin's DB11? Oh, uh, it's the um, 1731. But I think I'm going to do the F-Type. Uh, you know what? Okay, I'll do Aston Martin DB11. Let me just see if I can upgrade it. That, I think, is a oh. Class B, right? Yes. yes. Okay. I upgraded the car. Uh, to what I actually power? really like. I really like the baby blue. Here, let me go back to reading mode. I'm going to make this is going to be a beautiful baby blue car. I'm changing mine to red. Are you using your Aston Martin DB11? Sure. What's your power? Um... Um, um, 
1753. 1877. Oh, okay. This should prove a challenge then. Let's see here. I need more money. That's uh, it's like the story of my life. Yes. I guess it's not really novel news. Oh, Ooh, I like that. I, I, I got I more know. of a purple blue. Uh, I'm worried. What's up? No, no, it's it's about this technical interview. I'm oh, not getting much. Yeah. I'm just this the stress. It's making it difficult, and I'm not getting the best sleep. So, uh, frustrating. Frustrating. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to end the stream early, actually. Okay. Um. Yeah, well, we can get a few more laps in, or races in. Might play some more Destiny, then. You want to play Destiny? Oh, uh, outside of the stream. Yeah. By the way, folks, guess what? We're adding a new game to our repertoire. We're going to add, like, 20 of them once we finally get down a better uh, yeah. rotation. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way... Yeah, so uh, Destiny 2 is going to be uh, coming up. By the way, Robert, you know what else we could play? What? Genshin Impact. Pass. You don't want to play Genshin Impact? No. Are you going to start it? Oh, sorry. I forgot to press the launch button. Why do uh, you not want to play Genshin Impact? It just doesn't seem all that interesting to me. Like, it's one of those that's a okay. super heavy gacha games that I just like... Uh-huh. I... I'm good. But it's such a good story. I know what you mean, though. Like, I actually haven't played it in a while because... Ah, uh, damn it. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. What? You know what you did. We're streaming. Language, please. You want to get after me for damn it, but you say worse? You didn't say damn it. You yeah. said no, I. No, I said damn it. Did you say God? I did not. And then, and then you said damn it. I did not. After? I did not. Okay. 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 All right, everyone. False alarm. Put the pitchforks down. Put the bitchforks down? Pitch. Pitch. <laughs> pitch. I swear. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> <laughs> okay, whatever. You know what? It's fine. Let's see. I, I think I might have gone the wrong direction, but oh, actually, this one seems just like fun. What a coincidence! Honestly, at this point, I wasn't even paying attention to to winning the race. Yeah, this is just super fun track. This is a very fun track. I wish I'd seen this track before. I've never seen this track ever before, actually. Me neither. Like this actually feels like a right, like a right proper I, track. I have only. <laughs> You really don't like the Midwest, do you, Robert? <laughs> well, actually, I hate the Midwest because usually I'm fighting trains. And oh, I, you. is that what it is? Yeah. Is it just the trains? Yep. Wait, so what about this track feels proper to you? Well, the first off, there's trains? there's no trains. Okay, okay. And two, Good like, you know. the, the, mm -hmm. the turns and all that feel fun. Where, hmm, feel fun. How would you define a fun turn, Robert? Great question. I'm not sure I can. Well, no. What I mean is, okay, how did the, how would you contrast these turns to the other to the turns in other Midwestern tracks? Because they do feel different. But I want to hear your opinion. So, I actually accidentally took the left side the first time, or the right side, uh -huh. um, coming down where the tornado usually happens. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, I accidentally took that, and there's a bunch of, like, different turns back and forth. Like, it feels like a dirt track now. Oh, uh, I can see that. Yeah, it does kind of feel... I feel like everything seems more connected, if that makes sense. Yeah, 100%. Like, like, like the other Midwestern tracks, I feel like 
there's always some like weird bullshit secret jump that that lets you suddenly like almost teleport somewhere else. Yeah. This one just feels like a straight up trap. Yeah, there's no like secret, you know, tunnels or nothing. Which is strange why you said you didn't want to play like great dirt racing track like uh games like uh Dirt 5. Why? Because you said, I don't like the outside of the games, and then you're like, yeah, this is nice. What do you mean? I mentioned, I, I mentioned, that. yeah, you did. You were like, I don't like playing those type of games. I don't like playing dirt tracks and uh, dirt track games. And I'm just like, okay. So I never brought up Dirt 5. Um. So I'm not really sure what I originally said, but I definitely don't... Like, I actually... Pro okay, this track does feel fun, but the other kind of Midwestern tracks I also really enjoy. Like, this is different from, you know, the other Midwestern tracks, but I do like... Uh, I do really like the other Midwestern tracks, where there is the weird, you know, super hyper jump techniques. Well, this one, like, this one like I like because Mid this one I like because it is just the race. Like, like I actually like the Midwest probably the most out of all the regions, precisely because of all the trains and all the weird mm. secret jumps. It has gonna, quite a bit of those. One day I'm going to show you um, Dirt Five and see mm -hmm. what you think. Uh, fine, maybe. How much does Dirt 5 cost? I don't remember. I got it for free. Oh, 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 but it's not free to play. No. Okay. Have you have you played Pantheon Split before? I'm going to try this Pantheon Split. See okay. This is all I was going to do Thousands Men Array. Oh. But, yeah, um, we can do Pantheon Split first. Okay. Wait, so are you setting or am I? You are. Okay, good. Just, just... Because you wanted to do the Pantheon split. And I was like, okay. You know what? I, I just realized I was using the DB11 for the last race, wasn't I? Yes, we both were. It's such a smooth, like, butter car. Like, I feel it, like it's just... It is a nice car, yeah. It's what... But you know what I mean, right? Like, it, you can, you can... It's almost like you can forget you're driving it. It's so smooth. <laughs> I do wish it was a little bit more powerful because it feels like it's a little underpowered for mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like multiplayer races because I want to use it there, but it just doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't really feel like um, it's a nice ride, but that's all it is. It doesn't really have too much to distinguish itself in terms of yeah. handling, I guess. You going to start the race? There we go. Yes, it started. What's I'm the power? I'm doing my B, B, uh, 1627. 1627. A very good year for some... An absolutely horrifying year for others. 1627. Actually, you know what? This is a weird one because this one's actually kind of hard for me to get around. Pantheon split? 1627. Oh, you mean you don't have too many uh, cars that are close to that? Actually, I have a lot. Oh, in fact, I have one that's exactly, but it's the M4 GTS. Oh, you want to do that? That's what I got. I'm using my BMW M4 GTS. Too. Oh, it, doing exactly... The same. Let's do it. There we go. Okay. Oh, that's right. Yeah, this only has fun. one color that you can do as a... What? It doesn't have custom color, really? Not not until you start it up. Oh, weird. Yeah, it is exactly one color base color. I guess BMW is kind of interesting like that. Alright. Sorry. No! <laughs> Wow, you're really, you just took off, okay. Wait, Amy Chan. <laughs> Don't you want to connect with me? <laughs> I, uh, no, now I want to get as far away as possible. <laughs> <laughs> I promise my connector isn't all weird shaped. Is it at least uh, a C? It, it's better than a C, it's a G. Oh. What the hell is C? Where'd that come from? 
You said connector. I was going protogen. Protogen. I'm Wait, gonna. Have... What? Uh, okay, we're. Well, I'm gonna have what? to just explain protogen to you later. What the hell is protogen? So it's a furry race. Um, oh boy. That is part computer. Oh, that would explain why I've never heard of it. Okay then. Yeah, that's Never what mind. it is. It's not G, it's um... My connector is C-shaped. Yes. <laughs> it's always been C-shaped. No! Dude. We're like literally, the distance between us is staying exactly the same. I'm surprised, honestly. Let's see. Alright, let me actually... Let me see what I can do. But I have to stop talking because... No! You have to keep talking! We're streaming! We have to be entertaining! Kind of. Uh, <laughs> kind of? <laughs> we, have to, we have to be entertaining enough for them to at least consider putting us on in the background. I mean, to be fair, I feel like um, I need more sleep to be more entertaining. Yeah, and this damn the job is not helping. We have to be uh, entertaining enough to be background noise. Okay, I'm dead. Yeah, oh, wow, you wrecked. Yeah, but it was... It was, uh... Was it a glorious yeah. wreck? It was, um... This is alright. I've had better wrecks. Usually my best ones involve trains, but... You know... The then Honestly, you have I not. Do, I do. You have I not do. wrecked yourself into Silver Core. What's that? It's um the Klingons honorable after. Oh. Man, who? Well, honorable it may be, but I don't want to go there. So. Uh... You don't want to go to a warrior's uh afterlife. I would prefer to go to Love Hina's. If you know what I mean. I mean, yeah, but... Oh Believe shit! Oh shit, you're catching up! I'm catching up! Huh? How are you catching up? I mean... Well, I am going forward, so... That appears to be helping. I don't know how I fell behind. Well, would you look at that? Victory! Honestly, I just stopped. I actually don't know myself. I wasn't really trying that hard. Yeah, I was like, I, I was, was like, like walking to victory. <laughs> you know what? It's because you were talking about Stovacore. Yep, that's what it is. What it was. That's I guarantee you. That's what it was. Oh shit! This is the long way around. I wonder if it's because I went left and you went, yeah, this is, this is the bad place. Oh, that must be it. Yeah, and I went, I went, I went, I went left and, and you went right. Let's Can I here. catch up? Can Robert catch up? I just have, I just have to crash you. What? <laughs> I thought you said no crashing. Ooh, right here, buddy. Yeah. I thought that was gonna be a win. Uh, I thought that was gonna be a win too. Just not for me. I'm. Wow. Okay. So. Mm hmm. I actually had given up. I was like, eh, I was just going. I was sleepwalking. The, the problem is, is that the long way has the more fun route. I don't know what you're talking about. The um. The uh, the long way is is the the fast way, or the um. Wait, is the long way the way for you where you have to go through those like those three really tight corridors? No, that's the short way. Oh, the one, so what's the long way? The one way the long way was the one when we went around at the last point, and you were like, "Oh, you went to the right, and I went to the left." Oh yeah, you did go to the. So left, I yeah. go to the right because. Well, my, partly because I keep forgetting that that's the long way, and partly because of the fact yeah. that that's the fun way. 
I suppose. Because there's okay. hops. I like hopping. <laughs> All right, so a thousand yeah. minarays. We're going to do. No. Okay. All thought, right, we can do thousands. I thought you liked thousand minarays. I do, but I feel like it might be. Um, I don't want to wear it out. But we can do thousand minarays. That's fine. Enough time has passed. Yes. Yes. Uh, let us go. I'm going to use my four GT. 1843. Uh, uh, four to GT 1830. 1833? 1843. 1843. Okay. Let's see. What do I, uh, what do I want to use? This is Let's actually... See. I think this is going to be the first race I actually use it. At least against people. Because I think I've used it to clean up some, like, career mode. 184... What are you using again? Ford GT. The Ford... Oh, the Ford GT. Interesting. Let me see. What do I got for it? Do I have it? My Ford GT is 1762. All right. I'll, I'll, I'll go with my Ford GT. Okay. It's not a bad car, but I just, I just haven't really wanted to invest uh, time and energy into... Oh my god, you're going to crush me. Well, that's the idea. Hey. It's more of the idea in that uh, I should be able to. Not because of anything particular except for the fact that I just have a sh okay. the higher ranking. You know what I mean? Okay. I do love thousands of rays. It's such a race. Yeah, this is going to be really interesting to see if I can beat you in this car. Let's see. It's Nitro is so fast, though. Well, I mean, it, it has its... <laughs> did you see that? Yes, I did. That was sick! And then oh, I hit no. a car. If I was not drifting right there, you would have wrecked. Don't ask me how I know that. I would have wrecked or you would have? You would have wrecked if I was not drifting. Uh, how do you know that? It's it's really just intuition. or it, like you, you develop an intuitive understanding of it. I don't... I legitimately don't really have a good way to explain it other than... You just kind of know. Fuck, this is a long way. I was following you because I thought it was the right way. Well, that's what you get for following the leader. Whee! I'm trying to learn how to be better. Well, I mean, I don't always know the right way. You know, you have to experiment. Oh, God, yes. Yes, I love those three jumps. They are the so much jumps. fun, yeah. They are so great. Oh, the handling on the 4GT is like... You know what's weird? The handling on the 4GT is actually shit, but it doesn't feel shit, you know? Is it? Because it actually feels good. Yeah. Well, if you actually look at the stats, it's like... That's why I think the stats are arbitrary and full of bullshit. No. They cannot be. We must have order. I then mean, we okay. must have better stats. I suppose you could say that they track more or less in general. Like it's uh, like a, a 2800 is going to be better than a 1600 no matter what. You know. But I do think that, yeah, there is something funky going on with them. Just drifting away. Let's see. Okay, so the correct way is this way. And... Then you want to go this way. Oh. Oh, shit. You want to crash. Got it. No! Okay. <laughs> That's not what I meant! <laughs> 
<laughs> that wasn't supposed to happen. That's was it now? You no, know, it wasn't. I thought it was partly part of your crazy uh, scheme to be great and was crash. Well, it was, but the problem is that um, the problem is that I was actually planning on on hitting the um, the jump. But I overshot, and so I ended up landing on the on the bridge, and I crashed. Ah. But I was supposed to have bounced onto the jump, and then, and then you know, bounced again, and, and then a bunch of other stuff. But nope, it was not meant to be. Oh, because I I lost my lead, and I can't get it back because of all that I just hit a single car and slowed down. Oh, did you wreck? No, I. But I. I Tap the obstacle car in it, and it lets oh. you get caught up with me. Yeah, that's that's upsetting. Actually, I'm surprised I'm doing this well. I mean, I'm right on top of you, so. If you say so. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Go. You got the. Why did you wreck? I was literally letting you. You had the opportunity to pass me! I was trying to wreck you! <laughs> you were trying to what? I was trying to wreck you when I messed up. Wow. <laughs> I was trying to let you pass, and you, you were like, this guy's taking pity on me. What an Basically. asshole. I'm, I'm, gonna wreck, I'm gonna wreck him. Basically. Okay, oh, and, well. and at the end of the race, my car was just like, eh, and crashed itself. Oh, uh, did 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 it go over the barrel roll jump? It tried to, and it just it didn't get very far, so it landed on its head. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what, yeah, that happened with yeah, exactly the same with me. At the very end of the race, it just kind of <laughs> barrel rolled and killed itself. It was like, eh. uh, it was like, uh, uh, no more, no more. Okay, okay, let's see what that. You know what? Okay, so let's see. Oh, let's do um, something in Shanghai. Let's see. Okay. Actually, you know what? There's a lot of there's a lot of tracks in Shanghai we haven't really done. Is there? Let me see. Okay, you know what we have to do, right? What? People square dash. Look at that glorious twisted bent. It's not a, it, you can't have laps on it though. It's a So? It's okay. It's 100. It's 120 degrees. It's long enough. Okay. Wait, are you creating or am I creating? Uh, I think I can... you are. I'm creating. Okay, good. What are you Just running? Just clarifying. That's a good question. I would like to run something I haven't run before, or I haven't really had the opportunity to run because of. Oh wait, I know what I want. Z4 LCI 889. No, there's a car that I recently unlocked, but I haven't really had the chance to mess with it. Can you do something uh, low-powered? Because I want to try my Leaf Nismo. Uh, or what car What car is it that you wanted to try? Well, let me see if I can find it first. Let me see. Um, It's, it's, well, it's not an S car. What? Where is it? it was, it's A-Rank? It's the, um, what's weird? I don't see it. It's the Janetta. Janetta G60 or something? I'm not sure I'm pronouncing it correctly. But I think it's pronounced Janetta. Do you see it? Um. Janetta. Where is it? Ortega. The. Is it a D rank car? Maybe it, if it is a D rank car, then maybe you can use your. your... Oh, it's the Janetta G60. What's your leaf your Nismo at? Well, is it class D? It's... Yeah, it's Janetta G sixty is class D. So if you're your leaf Nismo, what rank is it? Uh not even close. Seven fifty six. Ooh. Alright, I'll go with my leaf Nismo then too. Oh, what's your leaf Nismo at? Six eighty. Oh. Yeah, I, I basically I'm I'm I need to start it up, and I am not going to put in the effort to do that. So I am. I'm close. I'm just five away, five away from starting it up. Let me see. I don't even know how many cards I need. I mean, it's a nice car. If I had, if I had, 
gotten it further along before I got the 370Z, then I probably would prefer it over it, the 370Z, but... Yeah, but the 370Z really... is a lot easier to get over the Leaf Nismo. Yes. Yes, it is. Because the Leaf Nismo... Which is a shame. Yeah. Because the Leaf Nismo looks really... This is People Square Dash, though. It's like, okay, after this race, we have to play this track again. Okay. Just because... You! I saw that. I I'm, saw that. You I'm literally it. drifting to get my... <laughs> wow. I forgot how this car sips nitrous. Yeah, it, remi it reminds me of the E-Tense e a lot. Yeah, I can see that. You know what? It probably is, is better than the E-Tense. Why I want to start... Oh. Why I want to max oh, it out. Far. Yeah. Come on, baby. How am You're I right so here. far behind you? What are you talking about? You're right behind me. Woo. All right. Oh, you want to go that way, do ya? I want to get out of your range of trying to kill me. Kill what? Come on! Don't be shy. Step into the line. I promise plenty of gumdrops and candy canes. I mean, now that you offered that, of course. I'll let you crash me all night. Mm. You take a lot of the fun out of riding, ramming you in the back. <laughs> 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 Here I was. I was, I was so looking forward to ramming your backside, and and now I don't want to. <sighs> well, I mean, maybe that's what I wanted, or maybe it's not. You never know. Okay, we're. That's enough. That's enough. What can't you handle your own jokes? I have only so much innuendo. Yes, I can only handle so much. In your end before it before it gets too big. I really like I mean I'm sorry Robert, but your innuendo is too big and too hard. It's the shaft, Robert. I can't handle the shaft. It's, <laughs> this is real this really is getting out of hand though. <laughs> it really is, yeah. Yeah. But this race is amazing. This is actually yeah, it's pretty Oh my god. Oh shit, am I gonna oh good, I'm not gonna break. You wrecked me! Oh! Oh! Ah. oh. Well, I guess this means I have permission now. Huh. I don't even know what I did! No, it's over! <laughs> <laughs> okay, at the very end. <laughs> I don't even know what I did. You, 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 as you were driving by, your rear driver's side tire. Um, pushed into my uh, front passenger tire, and that wrecked me. And you were going faster, relatively speaking, so I got wrecked. Okay. I got choice faced. I get the feeling now that maybe a lot of people were wrecking into me, not intentionally, because that's how okay. I've been getting wrecked in multiplayer a lot, and I don't even know what I did. Oh yeah, no people. So people have been have been yeah. If you're going, if you pass someone by and your rear driver side tire hits their their uh front passenger side tire, usually that'll wreck them. Hmm. Okay, we're doing that race again, but we're using more powerful vehicles now. Okay. What Let's are you running? See what we got. Uh, My Asterion versus your Asterion. What's your Asterion at? Uh... Let me check. It's four star, right? So yes. Okay, mine's three stars, so I'm two thousand six hundred twenty-nine. Hey, I'm, I'm twenty-six twenty-two. But it's you're a four star. How is it? How are you under me? Because I just haven't had the chance to put more stuff into it. Because I'm oh, broke. Oh, okay, gotcha. You're you're a fresh four star. I am. All right, people square dash. Asterione. Lamborghini, your dear sister, your lady. You know what I feel would like, be nice. I I couldn't max it out at three star. Do you know what what I think would be nice? 
Uh, oh, Hearthstone. wait, really? Oh, it's not maxed out at three star. I see. No, mine was not maxed out at three star. In fact, you should know that because you're still three star. Okay. Like, <laughs> well, I just figured maybe it was something else, but okay. So what I what I think would be really nice is if they actually um, created a game mode where it it wasn't like a race. It was like basically everything in the track was. Ow! I, I'm sorry. Everything in the track was here. I'll wreck his pen. Uh, okay. You didn't have to. I wanted to hear what you were saying. Oh, right. So, you know how all the tracks basically are like a subset of all the the, the total available roads um, in a re in an area. So, like, want, a, like a, a world want, tour, I, a world tour race. Well, no, it's like it's a race where basically all the all available roads in that region are unlocked. Like there's no like everything is available to drive and there's no start and no end. And it's just like um like uh, a wreck fest or, or a collect fest. So you go you go on racing and you just want to like collect as many uh, nitrous bottles to get points or wreck people to get points. Oh, but it's like, like, it's like basically like a derby, a derby event, you know? Yeah. Well, what I actually, like... what I actually want is a way for us to uh, practice races solo without even without a mission, without anything, just just run I, the track so you can run it better. Oh, that. Yes, I feel like they don't want to do that because. Then people would get good too fast, and they want people to grind so that they can open up their 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 wallets. Possibly. You know I mean? Damn, Possibly. I completely passed you up, huh? Yeah, I uh, I think I took the wrong direction after I had. No, uh... what, what you were doing was you were three sixteen off of that jump, and do your I not want to? Look. Um, I thought three when you. 316 off a jump was a good thing. 316 off of a jump uh, decreases your airspeed. It does increase your nitrous, but it de it significantly decreases your airspeed. And while you were doing that, I did a perfect nitro off the jump, and I was able to make the turn. So 360 off of jumps are better when it's short, and you don't want a 360 off of jumps that are going into a turn. Because it's really, really difficult to make a tight turn. If, if you 360 off of a jump and there's like a turn right after, um, or the track bends right after a, th a jump, you don't, it's much faster to perfect nitrous off that jump and, and take the turn as tight as you can. Like that, that, that's what allowed me to, to go past you so oh, fast. That might uh, whereas, be, that might be what I need to do for this one race that's been, um, plaguing me for a while. Pro tip, pro tip. Yes, it's that was that was damn. I feel like that race was over so fast. Couldn't really enjoy it. Uh, yeah, that's why I don't like fast cars. You're a non lapped car. races. All right, all right. Pudong rise. How's that? Pudong rise. Oh, okay, uh, let's make this one the last one. Yeah, we can do that. That way I can get some sleep and yeah. All right. Okay, let's see. Well, it's got to be a special car. Something I really, really... You know what it has to be, right? Uh, The one that I can't compare compare with, right? The Mitsubishi Lancer Revolution. Oh, excuse me. Yes, it has to be the well, Mitsubishi Lancer Revolution. Yes, yeah, that has to be the level. It has well, what to be. You, what did you think it was? I thought you were going to pull out some, like, 3,000 rank. <laughs> I'm al almost. Not quite there yet. <laughs> Yeah, but no, no, no. It has to be the. It Mario has to be a Mitsubishi Lancer yes. Evolution. Yes, look at this. Plenty of time to really enjoy the the, uh, the scenery. And enjoy but... the questionable color choices you have chosen. What are you talking about? My color choices are spot on, friend. Look at look how what is yours all black and mine's fruity as duck. I I don't like the way yours looks. Like, legit. 
I, I, uh, something about the green is just wrong. I mean, okay, like, I know what you mean. It's supposed to look as gaudy as I can make it. Oh, so that's intentional. Yes, like, I'm intentional. Oh. To make it. Like, 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 after the episode of Pimp My Ride, they asked for the money back. That's oh, what I, okay. That's what, I, that's what I wanted. It's, it's like... Yeah, it, it's it's uh, it's okay. Then voice. then in that case, you did very well. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, it's 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 ironically pretentious. Is what what I'm going for. That was a very <laughs> close sir. That was a very close barrel roll. Yeah, you almost didn't make it. I saw that. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Uh, a close race. Uh, 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 oh shit! Not anymore. You. Yeah. Okay. Here, let me do the same thing to keep it close. Okay. I... Well, I wasn't. <laughs> I didn't have to... Okay. You're not helping oh, me get any better this way. I'm trying to make things interesting for our viewers, friend. Okay, fair enough. I mean. I suppose oh. I'll suppose I'll suppose we'll do the um the uh get better races later when we're not trying to introduce entertain mean, I people. I mean to be fair, you don't really need me to get better because it's like it's a race. You just have to experiment and learn from your mistakes on your own. True. I mean your time is gonna be your time no matter what. It's not like me doing bad is gonna make you suddenly get you don't get a speed boost. Every time your opponents. Well, no, I was thinking crash. more like I was thinking more like if you're ch forcing me to try and compete with you at your best, then I'm try I'm forced to try and do better. Oh, I see. Okay, that makes sense. You're right. I I didn't really think about it that way. If you feel like like you're you're having to face such a, you know like a really good player, okay. Hmm. Like I know, well, game wise, it like doesn't actually tough. change anything. You know what would be absolutely fucking cruel, though? Uh, a lot of things. What? If players actually did receive a speed boost every time someone else crashed. That would really hurt the people who crashed. Yes. And it would completely... Would be... it, well, the way that the game's designed, that would completely break the game. Yes, it would. Although, now that I think about it, what if it was the opposite? What if every time... Um, uh, you crashed. Everyone else got a speed boot. Wait, no, no, no. Everyone, um, no. Every time someone. Wait. Ah, I was trying to think of a way of. Uh, but I don't. Hmm. I don't remember. The inverse of that, though. So. Every time you crash, um... Oh, right. The players in front of you get a speed penalty. Well, so, the only way that would be fair is if it only happened if someone in front of you crashed you. Because if you, if you just crash and then you, and then the people in front of you got a speed penalty, well, that's not fair to them. <laughs> Yeah, you're right. Having said that, that would also open up a huge abuse mechanic where people at like the back of the pack would like crash themselves over and over. To yeah. <laughs> uh, I think it could, it could make sense as a mechanic. That's 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 like uh. That's that, basic... that would be a, tr a troll mechanic, though. On well, it. both of those would be a troll mechanic, but one of them would actually break the game so much worse. The first one, not the griefing one, right? Yeah, the first one would break it so much because then someone who could, who just needed to win a lot better would just keep crashing you and then you'd never have a chance. Yeah, okay. That was a uh, fun race. Uh, uh, yes, that was very fun. Okay. Uh, all right, well, I need to... You need to sign you really off? Think I, you really think I should take it easy, huh?
I really do. All right. I really do. Okay. I think you're stressing yourself out more than you need to. But be that being said, um, uh, I really this has I been your host, job. Scar Fox. All right. Signing off. And this has been Ooh. Drew and Peter. Signing off. Woo. Yes. <laughs> and Not as always, woo. Woo. stays classy. Stay classy, guys. Later. <laughs>